Why is my battery only 87%? Secret agent. What is up, everybody? Welcome back. We are at the Roseville uh, slash Crooksville Roseville Pottery Festival in Roseville, Ohio this year. Every now and then they flip flop Roseville, Crooksville. I wasn't even gonna film anything, but it's kind of gotten cool here today. Uh, I came in yesterday by myself and set up. I was here at 10.30. I was set up by 10.30. Didn't have first customer until 4 p.m. So craft show people, let's not have vendors show up at noon on a Thursday and set around for five hours, please. But anyway, you know, there's that. So thanks for that. Basically, we are in the middle of, we're behind this blue tent right there. They've made a circle of food trucks and food vendors. And then all the craft tents are inside. This is buzz you guys around a little bit. It's not a handmade, there's paparazzi. I've not seen anything handmade. I've asked a couple people and they're like, nah, I bought this. So I'm not even sure if you guys are gonna be able to see that. Hello. Hi, how are you today? Doing well and you? Also, I mean, deep fried Oreos. Supposed to have a fish fry here yesterday, that didn't happen. They were supposed to have a ride company come in, but apparently the guy that was mowing was like, hey, you guys can't set up because I'm mowing and then the ride company left, so that's not cool. Uh, I don't know what this is, Scentsy. So this side is Scentsy. That side is like, I don't know what that is. Uh, I got some cut wood guys. All right, so that's kind of cool. Clothes, I don't know. Cheap older pottery. So this is a pottery festival, so there's a lot of pottery here. We always give love to the donut man. Mini donuts. You gotta love the donut, guys. This is old school pottery you've collected? Yes, sir. There's 100 years worth of McCoy pottery. 75% of it was produced in that building right there. Right there? Right there, yes, sir. And this is Burley Clay down here now. Formerly Nelson McCoy Pottery from about 1950 through uh, mid 80s. Okay. When designer accents took it over and uh, in the early early mid 80s, they uh, it burned down for the very final time. So just... But we display our collection consists of about 2,000, 2,200 pieces and it spans 100 years of collection starting with the 1904 stuff there and all the way around the table through the 20s, 30s, 40s, 50s, and 60s. 60s, funky 70s, dinnerware in the 80s. <laughs> the funky 70s. <laughs> Let me see if I can guess where that right here. Yeah, oh yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep. Yep. So what's a piece like this go for? That base at 50, 60 bucks. The bigger one would probably bring 140, 160, maybe so 200. So you're, not, you're not selling, you're just showing? No, sir. This is oh, all okay, our okay, personal okay. collection. Well, this is interesting. The TV lamps, yes. Yeah. I've had Set to them on top of your TV, right? Yes, or... I've had to explain that to many young people well. this weekend. <laughs> that uh, TV screens used to be glass. You couldn't have any light reflecting <laughs> off of them at night. You couldn't watch TVs. Cool, thanks, man. Hey, no problem. Thanks for stopping by. Absolutely. Cool stuff. And then I think Burley has this set up over here where they're just... Kettle corn can't go wrong there. There's the man. Okay, so I, I, okay, a little bit of, they're having a pizza eating contest today. So should I enter? Yeah, why? Why not? Why not, exactly. Maxwell's Pizza? Yes, sir, Maxwell's Wood Fire Catering. We cater weddings, any private party, we'll be there. So you guys are in? Zanesville, McConnellsville, and Columbus. And I'm sure you can just look up Maxwell's Wood Fire Pizza, right, and you guys will pop up? Yes, sir, Maxwell's Wood Fire Catering. Maxwell's Wood Fire Catering. You guys are here supplying pizza for the event or just helping out the show or? No, uh, we're here, uh, sir serving the public and also we're gonna uh, donate the pizzas for the contest. Perfect, and it's Perfect. good, right? Yes, it's fire, no pun intended. It's, I like it. All right, so I'm gonna win, probably. I got. I have faith in you, there's some good Well, I tried to, to get in the 16 and under class, yeah, and they right. were like, no, you're older than that, so. <laughs> cool, so that's at 7 p.m., we'll do that for sure. So give them a shout out, or if you guys are in this area, get a hold of them for catering, right? So you guys are firing pizza right on site. Cool, so he's gonna like throw a pizza in for us. Oh man, I can feel the heat from here. Oh yeah, about 500 degrees. And how long are you gonna take on that? About six minutes. Oh, holy cow, that's my kind of pizza though. When we do these fairs, I try to spotlight a vendor. Cool. You guys are pretty cool, so. We appreciate it. All right, so he's rolling that right out. I'll Fresh see. out of the oven. That's what I'm talking about. Like a little bit of grease in the, in the pepperonis. Yep. We bring the fire to you. Bring the fire to you. They bring the fire to you, that's awesome. 
All right, guys, so what I was saying is I wasn't really gonna record much because uh, there's just, there's not very many vendors here and a lot of it is buy and sell vendors or large companies like Pink Zebra. We do craft show bingo, basically. Get your Scentsy, your uh, nail, uh, what's the nail one? I never, I never remember the nail one where you press the nails on, but this has turned out to be kind of cool because now we have Medivac here or Aerovac as they're calling it. Life Flight as you guys might know it as. Uh, and they're giving helicopter rides today. Did you guys blow that off with the chopper? I'm sure. <laughs> it just didn't help, man. Helicopter helped it out a bit. Nice. Uh, not a step. I don't know why you would want to step, but it's not one. Uh, also, danger, because I don't know why you'd want to stand there, but also danger. Are you okay to be on my YouTube channel? So you guys are what we would call life flight or medevac, or is yeah. that the same thing? Kind of. Okay. Yes. So we, yeah, we're a medevac, um, but our, we're airevac, I guess is our name. Just yeah, a different same name. idea. And you can fully just transport one person or multiples or just? Just one person. Two man crew if possible, four man crew, plus two patient. Two man crew. So I'm the nurse. I usually sit over on the right side. The paramedic sits here. Okay. And then patient head is here in the paramedics lab. Feet goes up by the pilot. And you guys basically have the same amount of equipment as an ambulance? Or... Yeah. How'd you get into that? I so... was a senior in high school. My dad had to be flown to Cleveland Clinic and they had a big enough bird that I could fly with him and yeah. they let me. <laughs> See. So I'm like, I want to be a flight nurse. Life-changing cool. situations. Yeah. Crazy. So cool. So it's really cool. Fast as this can go is 130 knots indicated airspeed. What is that in miles per hour for normal 140, people? 140, 750. 150 miles an hour. Full speed, now, and, but that of course is moving through the air. So if I've got a headwind, that yep. actually slows down how fast I'm going over the ground. I won't be doing a true 150 miles an right. hour. But if I've got a tailwind and I can do and I can move through the air at 130 and I have a tailwind of 20 knots, now I'm doing 170 miles an hour. Hoping for tailwind. Tailwinds are awesome <laughs> for when you need to get somewhere quick. Yeah. yeah. Come on. Now, you, you, you like so to go well. as fast as you can, yeah, right? Of course. Oh, of course. Of course. <laughs> well, cool, guys. Thanks for the information. Awesome. See you guys on YouTube out there, you know? <laughs> Put you guys out there for the world. It's a great thing you do. I mean, it's crazy. Like, yeah, it's an air ambulance, right? I mean, pretty much. Yep. I don't think that belongs on there, but I mean, it will. It's, <laughs> I put it on there because it's an eye poking oh, level yeah. for kids. Someone bumps it, that's better than a kid poking his eye yeah, out. Yeah, well, at least you have a paramedic with you. Well, there's that. There's that. <laughs> All right, guys. Have a good one. Thanks for what you do. Okay, so what I was saying is I, I wasn't going to do much filming here, but now we've got petting zoo, which I'm going to show you next. We've got pizza eating contest. We got air evac. They're also bringing in a helicopter for you can pay and take a flight. I ain't going to do that. I don't like flying. If you want to fly, please buy a business class or a first class ticket and fly on the biggest plane you can possibly fly on because you don't even feel it. I used to fly a lot. Since you asked, my funniest experience flying is we were in a really bad storm. One that actually scared me. I don't scare easily. And the lady beside me, it was me, it was a lady, and then and it was her husband and every time we hit some turbulence and i'm telling you it was a really really bad storm we flew right through the middle of every time we hit turbulence she grabbed my leg and his leg and squeezed as hard as she could and screamed and then she was like oh my gosh i'm so sorry i'm so sorry i'm so sorry i'm so sorry i'm like don't worry about it it's fine and then the next turbulence grab scream I apologize it was amazing funny got to know her <laughs> and him a little bit you know so we laughed it off when we got through the turbulence but yeah so the petting zoo is up here they have a camel he's been yelling at people all day when we walk by he yells at people because he wants them to feed him Right now, he's just getting some love. That was perfect timing, my dude. Thank you. <laughs> Originally, I thought he was going to be really wiry, but he is super soft and fluffy. I want to show you the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. You guys are you guys are in Zanesville, right? Bremen. Bremen. Okay, yeah. perfect. Okay, is he for sale? Because I... <laughs> no. <laughs> <laughs> and this guy is a gir. G-Y-R, gir. He's quite handsome. <laughs> So we have a mini Highland Cross. We have one Gur, and then the Gur. I'm coming to you, boys. Hi. I know. I was coming to pet you. Yeah. Didn't know there was going to be goats in this video, did you guys? These are Nubians. <laughs> now he's being a drama queen. <laughs> we have two old English South Down baby dolls. What? <laughs> well, I was coming to say hi. Check this out. He's been standing like this a lot. If he's just resting a leg or not. You gonna come say hi to me? Are you gonna come say hi? Okay, I'm not over there, I'm over here. Oh, he sees her with the cup. Her little pygmy. Hi, buddy. And literally the cutest thing on the planet, this little girl. 
Are you gonna come see me? She's so cute. Can I get your face? I just want to get a picture of your face. There you go. Hey. Just a baby alpaca. Hi. I'm surprised Mama hasn't bought you yet. I know she doesn't like the petting. Hi. What's your name? I'm gonna call you Kevin or Steve. Those are the names I use, buddy. You're stuck with it. Sorry. <laughs> I know, but I don't have food, and I'm sorry. Somebody will feed you soon. They will. Oh, and I forgot about the mini pigs. Um, they're Juliana's cross with Coon Coon. So there you go, and they are adorable. Yeah. I already did the Cooney Cooney thing, not gonna do it again. The fire department is coming tonight to do an evac or an extraction from a vehicle. And then they're gonna have like, I don't know if they're having fire eaters or fire something. They're doing something with fire, twirling it. I wanna show you guys, she left. <laughs> Dare she. All right, y'all, so we are setting up the pizza eating contest. Oh, no, no. You don't mind me talking? No. <laughs> talking to myself, kind of, sort of. It's a weird thing doing a YouTube channel, but you kind of <laughs> just sit out in public and talk to a camera. <laughs> Looks like the rules are you get two slices, and whoever can eat those two slices the fastest. So that's good, because I wasn't in the mood. It's been hot. We've been here since 10 a.m., virtually no sales, just sitting, staring at people walk by. Not people walking by, there was nobody walking by. So, and so I guess it's how fast can I eat two slices of pizza? Not feeling well, not into this as I was, you know, at two o'clock this afternoon, but we'll see where it goes. Wish me luck. Gonna be ugly. Okay, update. Nobody knows what the rules are. She said they gave us 10 slices each. Guess it's down to me. That guy right there. That guy right there. I'm gonna talk to him. Somebody somebody left or decided not to participate. You the other guy? How's it going, man? <laughs> Good. Do you know the rules? Because I, I thought it was two slices as fast as you could, but then they, she's like, well, they gave us 10 slices per person, so I don't know. Well, what, if, what about this? If it's 10 slices, you and I just sit up there and have a nice casual slow eat. We'll get all 10 slices. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you're supposed to bring your own water? Oh my gosh, they didn't tell me anything. Well, it is what it is. Okay, so I guess they donated an entire pizza to each person. So I guess it's eat the whole pizza. All right, so. Oh, it's half pizza. It's not a no, what's a half? Yeah. Hey, we need napkins first. Two so slices, one big slice of one. No napkins, that costs extra. Man! What about water? I've never done this before, so let's see how it rolls. I don't need a plate. <laughs> yeah, which one Just napkins, napkins, please. That's the crowd out there. Basically half a pizza, so... Have you done this before? No. Oh, great. I have. He's trying to psych me out, isn't he? I've done it before. Did you win? The fastest to eat. Your whole pizza wins. You All right, what's your name? Win? Scott. Scott. You want a free large pizza. This is Scott. Oh, yeah. I, <laughs> I find myself All on right. stage very uncomfortable. I'm going to count you down. Three, two, one. Come on. Go, 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 Two Two big ones. There's four small ones. That's it. Hold the gel's getting tired. Yeah. That bitch is a bit dry. It's a bit dry right there. <laughs> Checking out the competition, aren't you? Uh-huh. Yep. <laughs> Think of the goats. Think of the goats. <laughs> on, Try not to choke. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Get it off of that. Are you sweating now? <laughs> yeah. Do I win a prize as well? I can't do it. I'm taking a Your name is Sean. <sighs> I don't want to move. I might throw up. Barefoot McGoy, guys. 
down there. Check him out. He's awesome. Good job, brother. I turned around. I ate the crust first on the second one. So I, I had the sauce that, on the yeah. <laughs> I couldn't eat the crust. Oh, I know that was that was rough. All right, this is Scott. Scott did an awesome job. It was dry, right? It was. Yeah, it was dry, <laughs> so man. we did awesome. Dry and burnt. Good job, man. Thought I was gonna die a couple times, but I did not. I don't lose. I don't like losing, and so I won. No, that's arrogance. <laughs> so now I get a pizza certificate from a local pizza restaurant in Crooksville, Ohio. I'm gonna throw up, but we'll have to go pick that up at some point. I like trying new pizza, and I've never tried that, so we'll do that. Did I win? Yeah, I won. <laughs> So, were you competing against anybody? Uh, Scott, the guy in the white shirt right there. Is it close? I'll explain details when I'm finished, but if you guys saw my awesome technique right there, halfway through when I turned the crust around and ate the dry crusty part first, so I'd have sauce on the rest of it. I just made that up on the fly, but I was about to choke to death on the dryness of the crust, but the pizza was actually really good. The sauce is fantastic, but when you shove half a pizza in your face in, I don't know, a couple minutes, six, <laughs> three, four minutes probably, then, you know, it gets, everything gets dry. So, I might go throw up. To get into like Sean YouTube mode, huh? Oh Lord, I'm not I'm not gonna There's a thing. There's a thing. It happens. It happens. Okay, I wanted to spotlight one more artist. Very young, just graduated high school, right? Going to college on a full scholarship. Yeah, tuition. Based on Academic. academics. Pottery maker. What caught my eye the most was this one little piece right here. It's perfectly round. It fits all the way around perfectly. The lid's not loose or wobbly. It's just tight and it's really awesome so you can see her name there and we'll talk about a little bit what's going on with her and how you can get your hands on this in a second but i just wanted to do a pan around and show you guys how cool it is <laughs> This is my favorite piece, and probably that one there. But you do like very earthy, and I like that. Like, mm -hmm. I like simple too. Simple, right? Yeah. Some awesome mugs that are almost big enough for the lovely H. <laughs> I'll have to work on that. <laughs> That's a hard standard to right? get to. I need a mug this size for her, so we just slap <laughs> a handle on that and we're good to go. So, this is Olivia. Hello. <laughs> And where can everybody, where can they find you? Uh, my, I'm most active on my Instagram. I'm gonna begin posting more, like all this stuff I'm gonna, I'm working on posting on my Instagram. That's just Olivia Kaiser Pottery. My Facebook under the same name, and it's also in the bio of my Instagram. I'm gonna start an Etsy soon. That's my goal for the end of the summer. And I'll post all this stuff on there. And also in Athens, like art markets on Instagram, I post the, the events that I'll be at. The <laughs> stuff that I post, you can always DM me on my Instagram and I will, I can ship it to you if you see it on my Instagram, just DM me. Answer any questions. 
and she can answer any questions. I pulled the camera away, sorry. So, you guys heard it, you guys have seen it. Do you have other things like sitting at home or is this what you have right now? Donkey Coffee in Athens, they carry her mugs because they're awesome. I'll give you guys one more one around. I get a piece of candy too, right? Yeah, peppermint Sweet. are free. So that's it guys. That's it for the Roseville Pottery Festival. Go click all the buttons, like, subscribe, thumbs up, tell a friend, tell a neighbor, tell a stranger. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.